In the last couple of weeks, I've decided to take a trip to learn about Japanese wood craftsmanship. Based on in-depth interviews of craftsmen and witnessing the work of those who specialize in various fields of traditional woodworking, I've learned the distinctive features that combine a craftsman know-how with the understanding of wood anatomy. Today I'm going to talk about the type of wood that is most commonly used in the structure of Japanese carpentry traditions that are rooted in the island's country's varied topography, moderate climate, abundant water, and rich biodiversity. Four of the most commonly used woods in Japanese structures are Japanese cypress, Japanese cedar, Japanese red pine, and Zilkova. Each is recognizable to an experienced daiku, not only by its color and wood grain, but also by its scent when it's freshly planted. Japanese cypress is the daiku's favorite wood, the gold standard in traditional Japanese carpentry. Thanks to its high strength to weight ratio and to the straight, even grain that allows optimal workability. Tight grain Japanese cypress retains oil longer than other woods, resisting water and insect damage and imbuing it with unparalleled longevity. As attested by the pillars of Horyuji Temple, some of which are over 1,300 years old. Japanese cedar is a second highly favored structural wood native to Japan, with excellent properties of strength, workability, water resistance, and longevity. A fast-growing softwood that thrives in varied climates and soils, Today, it is commonly used for most kinds of wood construction. Japanese red pine is widely admired for its hardy, rustic qualities. Pine trees may grow in irregular branching forms, and harvested timbers feature frequent knots and varied grain. It is not uncommon in old houses to find large arching and twisting pine trunks used as primary roof beams due to their superior strength. Zelkova also known as Chinese elm, is the only hardwood species traditionally used in Japan for structural purposes. Zelkova has irregular curving grain that makes it more difficult to work than comparable softwoods, but also imbues it with decorative appeal. 